वेलकम बैक गाइस जी शिवाजी विद एपिसोड टू द पैलेस इज फॉलिंग सो आई एम गोना डू ए क्विक रिकैप ऑफ व्हाट हैपेन ड्यूरिंग आवर लास्ट एपिसोड वी एंटर द सिटी थ्रू पोर्ट एंड मोड अलोंग द स्ट्रीट्स आफ्टर दैट वी एंड वी टेक इन द रूफ टॉप्स and then entered the royal palace where our companion or lover i'm not sure he thinks her as a lover our companion kalina died in the hands of his so something crazy had happened there You will have already see if you haven't seen my previous video. I suggest you go check that out. Karina got killed. I guess I'm not sure because I can still hear her voice sometimes in our game. So she just turned into some kind of sands and then entered our self before passing through other guys. So that's the recap of what happened. You would have already noticed that the royal palace is falling apart. This is because of events of what happened during the Karina death. Now we are trying to. Get ourselves out of this royal palace. Okay, that's not how we are supposed to do that. Yep. As you can see, the king, the prince's hand, hand is glowing. That's because of the new power that he received. Should I continue from here? We can now recall a certain period of time. I think this is the palace defense system which got activated. You could see we already passed all these areas, and the best way to kill these guys is to throw them out of the place. Doing the same thing again. That's the easy way to kill them. And as this palace is falling apart, so just keep the light on your feet. Once more, the wheels of suffering are set in motion by my hand. In taking Kailina from the island of time, I have changed the course of history. Without the sands of time, I never journeyed to Azad, never killed the vizier. Now he lives again, driven by the same mad desire. I promise no harm. Is this where I should resume the we'll tale next time? If you are wondering what the prince said now, I am being pushed deeper into the palace. He is talking about the ends of sands of time and war within. I will do the quick up of it later. My arm! What's happening? What has the vizier done to me? I don't. Oh! Everything had come full circle. The prince had resurrected his greatest enemy. Worse, he had accidentally delivered me into the man's hands, unleashing a nightmare plague across Babylon. As if this was not enough, the prince had nearly been transformed by the sands himself. Though he had avoided death, he had not escaped entirely untouched. Wake up, prince. Wake up. Wake up. The 
way behind you is gone, so you will have to find another exit. Shall I continue my story from here if you are called away? Be quick about it. Start moving. What? Who's there? The Be careful. Just the flanks are slick. Into Mind the sewer systems. And then only lost his shed. That's obviously a grated. Could have lost a hand or a leg with that kind of fall. But still, I think he had suffered some concussion because he started hearing <laughs> some voices inside. I know that's not a concussion, just kidding. Good, good. Head down. The prince has. Oh, they do not seem to like the light. is kind of confused with what's happening in his mind. So would anyone. But he neglected, decided to neglect that and started moving to find a way out of this place. Yeah. played Warrior Within and Sons of Time games, I suggest you go check them first because these are the arts after this show, after this thing. Yeah. That is transformed into some kind of creepy thing. I become a sand monster. You have become a sand Call monster. It what you have been given the ability to destroy your enemies. Now use it. You should be careful when you are in this formation because whatever you do, your hands depletes. What benefit is this? Even as I fight them, I grow weaker. Yeah. You kill them then, and let their lives replenish yours. Yeah. Feels good, does it not? I assume this is not permanent. It is. If you want it to be. I do not. But you will. Lead them into the light! Strike while they are blind! You guys have missed your light. So you can take them into a light. You can easily kill them. And that means they slip them into the light. The only way to replenish them is by sands. Where you can find by destroying objects or by killing others. Why then is this happening to me? You have been infected by the sands of time, as I am sure you have noticed. Maybe it's the dagger. Maybe it's all the time you've spent amongst the sands. Or <laughs> amongst the Empress. Either way, you are resisting. Mostly. Mostly? You did just transform into something rough. So I think the world is broken. Think of it this way. You have given me a gift. You're strong, master. Now, now. That explains the transformation. Have you not realized? I am your untapped potential, your unrealized dreams. I am part of you. Inside me? The prince got infected with the sands. So are everyone around him during the event of Karina death. 
this is not a permanent transformation he's gonna turn back when he touches water because water is pure form of everything now the prince obviously got stronger but his strength increase increased his health will deplete so that's a fair trade in my opinion now you should be way quicker on your feet because if you are not able to find sands within a period of time then you are gonna die is swimming back that's a good thing we should get in order now we'll follow up this video in we'll follow this video in my next video thanks a lot for watching this video guys hope you guys enjoy this i will see you guys later peace out